Hey, y'all. It's me again. Um, happy hump day to all you guys out there. I uh, hope your week's going well. Um, it's been a moment since I've made a video. I think today for me is going to be video number seven. Yay. So excited about that. Um, I never thought I'd get as much enjoyment out of doing these. Um, but it's kind of like self-reflection for me, you know, to go back and watch them and see y'all's comments and that kind of stuff. So if you do have a comment, please leave it down below. Um, hit the subscribe button as well. Um, so you'll be updated on any notifications that, you know, when I put out new videos and such. Um, I love your feedback. I really appreciate you guys listening. Um, I was actually kind of outside doing some gardening. Kelly had me doing a few things out in the yard that she wanted done. And I was like, you know, I need a break and I need, I need an excuse to have a break. So um, I thought that maybe I could get away with this one. You know what I mean? Um, because she's, she likes me making these. Uh, I think she enjoys watching them as well. Shout out to you, hon. Um, anyway, um, I try to make this kind of quick. Try to be random as usual. And I'm going to probably ramble too. So you guys be patient, all right? Um, I think what I wanted to say really quick was... Uh, about living our life for happiness. Um, that being said, it's been almost two years since I transitioned. Um, best decision ever made in my life to live my life authentically. Every day I wake up, I am um, overrun with joy, okay? I'm extremely joyous. Uh, I planned my transition out. It was over a period of about four, four years, which is a really long time um, for a gender transition. However, I think with doing that for me, it allowed me to accept myself in each part of the journey um, and get through each step uh, more calculated, uh, if you will. Uh, I did have loss, you know, I've, that's, that's the way it is with anything. When we make a decision, there's always pros and cons, right? Um, so th there were some cons, but, you know, more, more pros than cons, I, I assure you. Uh, you know, if there's anything negative about me transitioning off the top of my head, I um, can't really think of any, to be honest. Um, you know, lost a couple of family members, maybe three or four along the way or something of that nature. Um, I've gained a lot of support, gained a lot of friendships uh, since then. And my relationship uh, with my wife. Uh, is so much more than I ever imagined possible because I'm able to love her in a way that I was never able to before because I was not able to accept and love myself. Um, took 49 years to do that, but guess what? I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Um, and I'm, I'm so excited about that every day. Uh, but anyway, just wanted to say to you guys, you know, if there's any of you out there that are considering a gender transition, um, or, you know, just maybe a really big decision, uh, in your life that's going to affect, uh, the rest of your days, um, think it through, write down your pros and cons, weigh it out, uh, think about how it's going to affect you down the road. Um, don't, don't live for yesterday. Because yesterday only keeps us from enjoying today and tomorrow. And it takes away from that. It truly does. I promise. Um, I, I don't know that I have any regrets. I do not like the fact that I spent so much time not living as my authentic self. But, you know, it is what it is. And I've decided that to move forward, I'm going to enjoy the rest of my life the way it is. I can't think about yesterday, but I can enjoy today and definitely plan on enjoying tomorrow. And that's exactly what I'm doing. Um, had a great uh, little Zoom class with some associates yesterday, uh, as well as my voice coach that I've worked with for um, a year or two now. Um, she's incredible. And um, that went really well, and I was so happy to be a part of that. Uh, my voice is still something that I continue maybe um, to keep in check a little bit uh, from time to time that Maybe it's one of the most disport things about me, to be honest. Um, but these videos have helped me a lot because I'm able to watch them and see how I talk and my speech patterns. And I know they're way too fast. I get that. I need to slow down. Um, that's just kind of how my, my brain fires. And as it does, I just roll it off my tongue. Um, and sometimes it doesn't sound the way I want it to sound because of that. 
So that's something I do need to work on for myself. Um, but listening to him, you know what? I didn't sound near as bad as I thought I did. <laughs> so all this time, you know, I'm bugging my wife like, hey, hey, honey, you know, how do I sound? You know, hey, baby, I don't think I sound great today. And, you know, mm, I'm down in the dumps today because of that. You know, um, I watch these now and I'm like, you know, I sound pretty good. I, I'm, I'm doing just fine and I'm happy with that. But anyway, listen, um, again, just wanted to say thanks to all of you all out there that watch and subscribe to my channel and leave those comments. Keep them coming. They're great. I love reading them and I love responding to them. Um, if you guys have any questions, I am an open book. As long as they're respectful, I'm okay with answering some, some questions, you know, um, about my gender transition, uh, maybe things before, during, um, you know, questions of that nature. So if you have them, you know, post them. Let's see if we can't get you an answer to some of those, at least from my perspective, uh, as someone that has gone through that transition. Anyway, you, you guys take care. Great to talk to y'all again and, uh, see you soon. Bye.